Now, what you see in front of you, all of you know this. You've been studying this from junior classes as well, and you have done it in your 11th class. You're done with your chapter of cell and cell division. You see that this is cytokinesis happening. During cell division, we have karyokinesis, and after that, the daughter cells detach or separate, called as the cytokinesis. The cyto is cell, and kinesis always means division. Karyo is nucleus, kinesis is division. Now, cytokinesis or the division of the cell in plants, very easy. The way we are going to tell you, very easy. Is regulated, cytokinesis is regulated by a naturally occurring substance or regulator called as cytokinin. We are very lucky that they did not give a new term for us to learn. It is simply known as cytokinin because it is enhancing or promoting cytokinesis. Okay, so we will talk about cytokinins now. Yes, so till now we have done studying about auxins, gibberellins and the third growth promoter we are going to do is cytokinin. Kinin. Ready? Come, let's do it. How was it discovered? Accidentally. By a series of experiments. Okay? And the people who are credited, we will remember them. So, in this case, it is a gentleman called F. Skoog. You can just remember Skoog. That's okay. So, Skoog was working on tobacco, tobacco plant, yes, callus. You know what is callus? So what is callus? Callus is the undifferentiated mass of cells. Yes, you see callus formation in plant tissue culture. So Skoog had the nutrient medium and he was examining or experimenting on Tobacco plant, the plant, the callus formation was with respect to the tobacco plant. Now, in this nutrient medium, what he did was he tried to add substances which will cause the growth or proliferation of cells in the callus. Please pay attention. He took extracts of vascular tissue. Pay attention, he took in one, in one experiment, he took extract of vascular tissues to see if the callus formation is enhanced. In the next one, he took yeast extract, yeah, the unicellular yeast, it divides, coconut milk and the fourth one, okay, I'm going to mark it separately. You know why. If ma'am is marking something separately, it's important as a question. In the fourth, in the fourth experiment, he took herring sperm DNA. DNA of herring sperm. Okay? With me, everybody? Let's pay attention. He was trying to grow tobacco callus. Callus is the undifferentiated mass of cells. In one experiment, he added extract of vascular tissues, xylem and phloem. Yeast. Third one was coconut milk. Mm. And fourth one was herring sperm DNA. Let's see what he found. He found that the one which I marked, the herring sperm DNA, that particular culture had maximum growth. Okay, the maximum proliferation. Then he tried to isolate the substance which is causing this 
proliferating effect and he found that the substance is kinetin causing increased kinesis easy chemically this kinetin because it is the dna nothing but modified adenine adenine is a purine base you have studied about that so it is a modified adenine modified adenine okay and called as kinetin but these were not isolated from plants yet whether such substances are found in plants skug could not find out okay so kinetin does not occur naturally in plants so what is there in plants now the credit of that goes to miller c miller we will remember this are you writing it down we should write it down are you writing it down it's very important miller found that in z maze you know maze is the botanical name is z maze yes in the endosperm of maize maize is a monocot endospermic seed he found that zeatin is like the kinetin which skug found so because he extracted it for the first time listen to me carefully for the first time from z maize he called this kinetin like substance as zeatin and you can write it down it was also found in coconut milk okay so zeatin is a cytokinin which promotes the process of cytokinesis and it was the first instance zeatin from the maize plant of naturally so it was the first instance of a naturally occurring adenine based cytokinin to be isolated from plants okay so they were extracted from corn kernel and coconut milk as well these are the two rich sources of zeatin otherwise zeatin these were the two rich sources of zeatin and naturally they found out that wherever in plant active growth is happening yes cytokinins will be present in the regions of rapid cell division we can isolate cytokinins they are transported through the xylem and the place to extract them like i said cell division root apices developing shoot buds and young fruits 